hi welcome to another tutorial with me my name is Ivan today I'm going to show you um, in the levels adjustment just how to find the, the most white point gray point and black point um, the white point and black point is quite easy um, the gray point takes a little bit of time um, and I'll show you exactly how to do that I'm going to start with the white point then the black point and then we'll do the gray point last okay so you want your image open go to image and adjustments and threshold pull it all the way to the right to make it as dark as you can and you can see here you've got the white points so let's just zoom in so you want to make sure you have your eyedropper selected um, and you just want to hit the shift brings up the, the point tool and click in there so now we've got the, the point there if you make a mistake let me just go here you hold shift select the, the pointer and just drag it off the image and it gets rid of it in case you've put it in the wrong spot okay so that's the white one uh, let's just zoom out again drag it all the way to the left hand side then we're going to do this for the black that looks about right so we can get it in I'll probably do it down here um, just zoom in a little bit okay so we hold down the shift Okay, so we cancel that. There we go. So we've got our most white point and we've got our most black point over there. So now let's do the gray point. First, you want to create a new layer and you want to fill that layer with 50% uh, gray. So either go up to layer, new layer fill, solid color. Um, if you want to name it, it's fine. It's okay. And then change that to 50 and that will do it or I'm using uh, Windows, hit Shift Backspace, 50% Gray is one of the options here. So select OK, and that changes it to Gray. Now don't worry about that, we're going to change the layer blending mode to Difference. There we go, so now it brings out all the Gray spots. And now we want to do the Threshold again, I'll show you a different way to get to it. On your Adjustments layer here, go to Threshold. Now you can see, you want to slide the slider all the way to the left, um, so it can be as white as possible. And just slide it a little bit. There we go, and let's choose the grey point. <clears throat> I need a bit of a solid colour, so to make sure I select it properly, I'm just going to slide it a little bit more. There we go, so I'll probably choose just around here, hold down shift and click there we go Control o to zoom out again now that we've chosen that we don't need these two layers um, either Control click or shift click and just delete right so we've got our three three selections the white the black and the gray so now we want to hit the adjustments layer go down to levels white click in there white black click in the black one and the gray we click in the gray one and that's as easy as that so that's a before and that's a after and this can be used for portraits it can be useful for many different landscape scenes um, anything it just brings out all the colors um, and does that for you okay well I hope you enjoyed this tutorial if you found it helpful please hit the like button um, and please subscribe more to come. Thank you.